Hello buddy, it is Ray Vertex and welcome back. Today we're doing part 14 of Beyond Two Souls. Now we're getting really close to the end, so this could be the last episode or second last. Good night, princess. Hope you guys have a good Thursday. Okay. When will I see him again? And let's get right into it. I don't know, honey. He hasn't left his office in three days. He loved his wife and daughter more than anything in the world. But we can try again tomorrow, okay? Now you get some sleep. Oh God. Oh God. It's a little girl, it wasn't little, but she's not that little. But it's a nine, ten year old girl, maybe eleven. Maybe even 12. Now this is creepy. Beyond to Souls classified horror game. I'm joking. Mm. 15. I mean, this, this can be kind of scary for a kid. You don't just follow a spirit to a room. Tony, what are you doing here? It's late. Go back to bed. What? What did you say? It was so quick. Mommy couldn't do anything. But it didn't hurt. Stop it, Jill. It didn't hurt at all. You hear me? Stop it right now. We are here, Nathan. We're right by your side. Come on. Lord. We love you, darling. We'll always love you. Talk to me again. Jody. Make them come back. Make them come back again. I can't. They've gone. Please. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. I missed them so much. Darn. Like, I don't know if that makes someone more happy or more sad. I mean, it's nice to hear their voice and say that they're on your, like, right next to you. Like, they'll never leave your side. <laughs> but it'll also be sad. So I don't know if that made him a little bit happy or sad. He looks more sad, though. Black Sun, so this is like This is after Dragon's Hideout Which so we're not dead though. That's good. The active condenser in the Republic of Kazakhstan has been destroyed and the rift is now inaccessible We are now the only nation with access to the infant world 
This situation opens up new strategic and military perspectives. And we're going to launch new programs to discover possible energy resources and develop military applications. We've already found ways of linking entities to human soldiers, and this is just the beginning. Now, this is more important than the race to space or developing nuclear capability. We have discovered a new world. A world for us to conquer. This is the beginning of a new era for our nation. You know, typical America. You know, even though I live in America, but always find something to take control and be powerful down in our state. That that sounds like something will actually happen, though. Some country will find like a new world or something. And We'll probably find a way to get control of it. Or something. Got on top brass getting you down. They were busy talking about their plans to take over the world. So I left them to it. Yeah, we played our part in all of this. We did the right thing. I don't think humanity needs a third world war. What are you gonna do now? Leave. Go somewhere far away and just try and lead a normal life. And what about you? The CIA has it all mapped out for me. Top tier, big car, golf meetings. I, mean, I haven't given him an answer yet, but it's worth considering. Listen, Jody, I, I know it's been complicated between us, and I, and I didn't always do the right thing. But maybe we could start again. You know, try and build something together. I mean, after all the stuff we've been through, maybe we could make it work. It's worth a try. <laughs> And that's a good ending. Well, I don't think this is the end just yet. This could be the last I mission. Do whatever it takes to make you happy. Or the next one. You'll forget about all this. Ah, there you are. Nathan's looking for you. Come on, I'll take you to his office. Later oh. on. Oh, you know what? I got a single malt in my office that needs sharing. Meet you in a few? Never say no to a single malt. <laughs> Great. I'll see you in a bit. Let's go, Jody. Nathan's waiting. The progress that we've seen with like all these characters is amazing. Like Cole, like back then we were in a little lab, and now look where we are. Nathan too. Jody didn't know how to control Iden. Thought that she, she wanted to die, and now look at her. She's at the CIA. Ryan's a good guy, and I think he really cares about you. Um. I know. Weird. It's hard to know how things will turn out. Now this game for being like like ten or eleven years old, maybe even more, maybe even less. It is still good. Maybe the graphics aren't like, let's say, Spider-Man Miles Morales, or something like that. But all right, here we are. Call me when you're done. I'll come pick you up. Okay. <laughs> I'm Stowe's little girl. Whatever Nathan says. Be careful. What? Be careful. Yeah, that sucks. That sucks. Come in! 
What's up, Nathan? Look at Nathan. This is his own office now. Well, he he did, but Jody. I'm so glad to see you safe. Nathan is now a billionaire. I get my part of the bargain. Now it's the CIA's turn. As far as the CIA is concerned, you no longer exist. Really? Passport. You're now Elizabeth North. No identity and no life. Five hundred thousand dollars. For services rendered. That should help make a new start. Thanks. I was gonna refuse it. Before you go, there's one last thing I'd like to ask. When my wife and daughter disappeared in that accident 15 years ago, I wanted to die too. I cried a lot. Banging my head against the wall trying to figure out why, why, why them. Never being able to hold them again. It was like a wound that wouldn't heal. But then you came along. And I realized they were still here all the time, near me. I just couldn't see. Gave me everything I needed to study the infra world. They were interested in military applications. I was interested in seeing my family again. It's taken me some years. Oh, Nathan! Succeeded in creating this. Hello, my darlings. Looks like they're in pain. So Nathan, they're in pain. To see them every day. Soon we'll be together. I'm working on a modified condenser that can communicate with souls of the infraworld. Speaking with the dead Jody. Can you imagine? What do you want from me? I want you to help me talk to them. I want to tell them what I'm doing. Until I finish my research, you're the only one that can do it. Nathan. No. No. Don't ask me that. I haven't heard their voices for 15 years. Since that day, I heard them through a little girl. You. I'm begging you. Jody, do this for me. Give me your hands. They look like they're in pain, so that's why I didn't want to do it, but.
darling. My darling. I missed you so much. Let us go, Nathan. <laughs> You're hurting us. You've got to let us go. Let us die! You... You're lying. Helen didn't say that. You did. You're keeping them here. They're being torn apart between two worlds. That, that's not true. You're lying. I know they want to be with me again. I know they want to be with me. They're suffering, Nathan. If you love them, if you... If you really love them, you've got to let them go. You can't cheat death. Cheat death? Death is nothing! You hear me? Nothing! Goodbye, Nathan. I hope you find peace. <sighs> Nathan, look at their face, man. Does that sound like... Does that look like happiness? He needs to realize. I thought Cole said he was gonna wait for us. I feel like Cole knew what Nathan was gonna say. He said whatever Nathan said. Be careful or something. I guess I'm taking that elevator. I'm guessing. I may be wrong. Wait, what? You've got to be kidding. CIA man. Hi, Dodie. Good to see you again. Ah. <sighs> Well, you put us in a very difficult situation, you know that. We can't let you go. Of course. We can't kill you either. We don't know what you'll do on the other side. So there's only one appropriate solution. Keep me a slave. We inject you with a neuro acid, which will put you in a permanent coma. Exactly what we did with your mother. A simple and elegant way to put an end to our uh, collaboration. Goodbye, Johnny. No. We will always be grateful for your help. You can never trust the CIA. No. Biden? Jody? Jody. You opened my eyes. It was so obvious, but I didn't want to see. going to accomplish man's oldest dream. Nobody will have to die anymore. No one will ever be separated again. What are you... What are you talking about? The containment field. I'm going to deactivate it. The infraworld will spread through our dimension. Life and death united in one world. Oh, God. He's gone it's crazy. Just souls on the other side. Beaten death, Jody. Everything's gonna be just fine. Oh my God! You need to trust me. It's gonna turn out fine. Nathan. Oh God! No, wake up, Ryan. Call.
turn that off. Jody. You're too weak, Aiden. I ain't Find giving up. Something else. Get help. Hurry. No. Who's the rest of your team? Vince and Nick? <laughs> they have three months leave. On a beach on some exotic island, no doubt. Lucky bastards. No. Hey, I've got a couple of emails I need to send. You mind if I do that before we crack the bottle? No problem. Okay. Um, the help I need is right here. Oh. Cole here. Hello? Hello? Get. You keep entities in this lab? Good God, no. They're all trapped behind the containment field. Aiden? Is that you, Aiden? If this is a joke, it's not funny. Why would Aiden be here without Jody? Give us a sign if it's you, Aiden. My mind. It's beginning to go now. What is it, Aiden? Where's Jody? Lead us to Jody, Aiden. Show us the way. This way. Over there. Okay, I get it. Want us to take the elevator? Is that it? Freeman, I have level three authorization. He's with me. Mm, I'm sorry, Mr. Freeman. You do not have the correct authorization for this level. Maybe you could make an exception. I just want to show him. Sorry, sir. This area is level four classified. You do not have the right credentials. You gotta get us past him, Aiden.
Desk 42, hello. Hello? Hello? I think you made a mistake. Could you check again, please? Cole Freeman and Ryan Clayton? I'm sorry, you are on the list. My apologies. Um, go on through. Thank you. Thank you. Hurry, Aiden. Take us to Jody. Come on. Right. Now where? There. Wait. Jody's here? Jody. Get out. Get Nathan. He's gonna deactivate the containment field. What? Why? Why would he do that? He's gone insane. He thinks he's gonna get his family back. We gotta stop him. Containment field. Oh, Christ, he's done it. He's done it. You need help? No. No, I'm okay. This way. Hurry up. Stay here. We gotta. We gotta go back to this place now. We gotta go. Oh my God. Bitch like you. Get out of my way. Clayton, get me out of here immediately, Clayton. Agent Clayton, that's an order. <sighs> Consider that my resignation. You're all gonna die here. You're all gonna die. <laughs> We gotta do something cool. Come on. Cool. Come on. Now, I didn't. Oh, Nathan. It's not working. No. I can't stop the condenser or reactivate the field. There's nothing we can do. Let's get out of here while we still can. Wait. There's one more thing I can try. Hurry! We're out of time! What are you doing? The portable containment field. It should protect me long enough to reach the condenser and trigger the manual self-destruct. Might be our only chance to close the rift. It's a long shot, but it's the best I got. Come on, you're talking crazy, Cole. We need to get out of here with the military clean up their own fucking mess. 
Jody, no. Paul's right. It's our only chance. Right? I always figured I'd die a hero. <laughs> been before so there's no telling what we'll find down here how much time do we have after we've activated the self-destruct system was designed to be activated remotely the explosion will be practically instantaneous we're not coming back Let's do this, guys. The condenser zone is on the other side of that door. We've got company. Oh, they haven't seen us yet. It's our only chance. Jesus. I hope you're right. Or a little trip into the info world might come to a sticky end. Too close to that. Let's go. Wait. Don't attract attention, or we're dead. No. I'm sorry, Princess. You're gonna have to go on without me. No way. I'm not leaving you. Fine. The Black Sun, Jody. Or nobody will make it. He's right. Come on, Jody. Darn, that was my fault. If he dies, it's my fault, guys.
come on. Darn it. Brian! I feel like no matter what, we had to talk to that girl. Nathan? No. Oh, I missed you. Oh. I missed you so much. You're the only one who can fix this, Jody. Come on. God, guys. I gotta get all these right. Like sun. Just take this no, and no, do it. No, no, those things are gonna slaughter you. Take the damn belt and destroy the fucking condenser. No. I get out of here before I change my mind. <sighs> you better not die too, man. I think cause a lot, bro. I help you. I like four died.
No one. We inject you with a neural acid, which will put you in a permanent coma. Exactly what we did with your letter. It's too late. It's too late. Guess we're going to have to kill him. I'm sick and tired of your stories. You're really going to get it. Aiden is his her brother. My to oh my god. Aiden is. Oh my god. What a twist ending, man. Our souls were bound together. I loved you and hated you for years. You were a part of me. Living, feeling, being in love. I love you, Jody. Growing old. I love you. So many things I still have to do. At some point, Luke will join them.
Biden? We made it. Jody, we made it. Biden? Ever since the Black Sun was destroyed, my memory has been disintegrating. I spent too much time on the other side. Now it's eating away at my mind, erasing what's left of it. My memories are all confused, slowly self-destructing, fading like a dream when you wake up. I'm losing my sense of time. I no longer know what happened before or after. Everything's playing inside my head at the same time. It's like watching the same film looping over and over again. A chaos of images with no order. So I've been writing night and day for weeks, trying to put my life down on paper. If I forget everything, these pages will be my memory. Three months after the fact, the investigation continues in an effort to determine the cause of the accident that cost 283 lives on a Pentagon military base. Government representatives confirm that the authorities are working hand in hand with the investigators to shed light on this appalling tragedy. The CIA is leaving me alone for the moment. I suppose they're too busy building another condenser to worry about me. I know they'll never abandon their experiments, now that they know it's on the other side. Honestly, I don't give a damn. Now I need to reconstruct my life. My life without Ida. For as long as I can remember, I dreamt of living without him. Untied, without his constant presence by my side. I got what I wanted. I've never been so unhappy in my life. I feel like part of me has been amputated. Crying all day. I know it's stupid. Shit. I miss him so much.
took months. Months of nothing passing by. And I woke up. I knew it was time. Time to start again. To build a new life. It was so obvious. Deep inside, I, I always knew. I just needed the silence around me to hear what I was feeling. It took me a while to realize how much I loved them. I'd been alone and sad for so long. I... I'd forgotten what it was like to love someone. We traveled as far away as we could. I had to learn to love again. To put my trust in someone to stop fighting and running away. In short, I had to learn to live. Ryan and I never talked about it again. As if it all never happened. As if the other side didn't exist. As if it could never come back into our lives. He's still here. He's still with us. Well, that's good. That's a happy ending. With Ryan, Beach, spending time together. No FBI, no CIA. Just her, her and Ryan. And Aiden, our brother. Come on, come on. I think the other one make up three three parts. Cause I can only record for sixty minutes. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I see things at night. Terrifying things. 
tell myself it's only nightmares, but I know it's not true. Once Pandora's box is open, it can never be closed again. No. It's oh. Nightmares. My God. It's what is about to happen. I've died twice already. I'm not afraid of death anymore. Oh my god. I hope you guys enjoyed this series. Next time, I'll kill everyone. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this series. Oh my god. I was so um, afraid I lost. So the next game we're doing is Miles Morales. No and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Goodbye. Bad.